Hi, this is Nikki and this is just part two of today's message. So <clears throat> I just thought I'm going to do some Nature's Oracle cards for us. And the two that I picked out were these, or that came out, were these. And no surprise, it was the rainbow and also the swans, the true love. And why also this is just so lovely is because the number that was in my head um, from the reading this morning was number 30. So um, to check number 30 in the Divine Love Letters books that I do. So if you want to, I mean, this is the best way to say to, to, to stay in touch with your twin's energy because I'll show you now because it is again... It actually just kind of really brings a smile to my face because it is so amazing how it works because it really is like having a conversation with your twin. So first of all, the Nature's Oracle guidance is true love is here to stay. You have found or about to find your soulmate. You'll recognize them because when you meet, it will feel as though you already know them. And then the second one was you're in the process of evolving and tra transforming into a higher state of being. This colourful miracle from nature has shown up to remind you to have faith and trust in your journey and the path you have chosen. So, I mean, just beautiful because the rainbows have been everywhere. The rainbow pass, which we are all on, which, you know, it's a choice, right? It is a choice. What path do you want to take? Now, if you watch the What's Up conversation... I was talking about that there's, you know, the guidance was this, there were three making a choice cards, right? What choice do you want to make to go on your rainbow path or to sink down into fear and doubt? Now, um, and the other thing I said about that on the, we're going into an 11 gateway, another energetic gateway. And actually on that day, I'm going to be doing a gong bath, which is sound vibrational healing. And basically to make your soul song louder, right? Now, <laughs> and then after I finished that video, it was number 30 that was coming into my head. So I am now going to read you number 30 from both of these letters. And this is what I mean by the magic of this book. So, <clears throat> you are light to me in the parts of me that I had long forgotten about and put in a box. But meeting you made me not want to live in a box. It made me want to become more of me. More of me so I can be everything that I am for you. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. So that I can be everything I am for you. Meeting you reminded me of who I am. I love you so very much. It's in the cells of my body, in the blood in my veins, in the beat of my heart. You're what I hear, what I see, what I smell. You are my senses. I count down the days, the seconds, until we can experience all of our senses merging together again in a beautiful symphony of love. We will create the perfect divine note to send out to the world and we will let our hearts sing. <laughs> I mean, just... I mean, this is why it's so incredible, because that's exactly what I was saying about doing the gong bath and about vibrational sound healing, which is why it's amazing. The next one was this, because it is, I was saying about, you know, the reading was very much about don't give in to fear and doubts. And the, the reason why I picked number 30 is because their, what their message to us was number 30. So stick with me. Don't veer off the path and start to give in to any fears and doubts that come up because of what I do or say. Know that it's all part of our plan because it's already set out for us. And as long as we stay true to our hearts and we don't panic, then we'll be more than okay. We'll have the romance of a lifetime. Every day we will <laughs> live and love like it was our last day on earth together. Every second we will make count. So stay with me. Don't veer off the yellow brick road. Because home is where the heart is. I mean, can you believe that? So to, you know, basically from... I mean, that's why it's so amazing. Yesterday I got on a train. And the last message, the last... For my twin's birthday card, I gave him a card which, said, which was a bear... 
and it said I like your face <laughs> now in um, when I got on a train yesterday the guy in front of me had little bears on his cap and so again I knew it was my twin though and I was like oh that's so sweet and then the letter yesterday was number um, it, it, there were two letters yesterday number 66 and 22 and um, so I read the 66 again and in it, it had the word bear. So, I mean, and this is what I mean. This is why it is so magical because all of these combined energies from people that are coming to me for channeled letters, that then they give permission for me to add into these books. You know, you don't have to, you can keep your letter completely private, but if you want to have it in the book, you can also put it in the book, right? because then it will help others because that's what's so beautiful about this it's the collective energies of all of us and all twin flames making these amazing miracles happen because when I got on that train and I saw his the cat the guy in front of me with the little bears and then I had the number in my head again so I went to read the letter and of course the letter had bear in it as well and I was like Oh, you know, it just brings a smile to your face all the time because you just realize that we really are creating miracles and it's a beautiful journey, but it can be, you know, that's the choice. You can see the beauty in the journey. You can use the tools that are available to really make you enjoy the journey, enjoy the twin flame journey and enjoy the twin flame spirit being around you everywhere really tap into the messages that they want to give you or there's another pathway which is kind of hardcore and painful and this serious this you know feeling of like desperation and lack and i know because i've been there right i did that for for a while before i learned the tools how to manage myself better on this journey and really it is about tapping into your own intuition and realizing it is your souls together making this journey the more you realize you're doing it hand in hand the more you use tools like this to tap into your twin spirit that's what makes it easier right that's what makes you realize you're always having a conversation with your twin and it's always the pair of you guiding each other home and believing in that bigger picture that's the other thing the biggest thing to do is to believe in the bigger picture um, and to understand you're here as part of a collective consciousness that is raising on the planet to bring love to the planet and that's what you can see in these books it's not just about love letters because some of the letters are very much you know saying about what we're doing lifting the planet in love and so this is why it's an amazing thing. So I just, again, just want to express my gratitude and to say thank you because it really is amazing. I mean, I am totally in awe every time. It kind of spins me out. But I'm just so pleased that I can help and I can, you know, help people. So if you want to have a channeled letter, it's only $10. If you want to have a healing where I tap into your energies and I see everything like a film. I give you a write-up and any songs that come through. I'm doing a special package at the moment. So if you buy two, you get three. So you can either do healings or readings. So I would do a healing where you can see what's going on with your energies. And then I do a reading for you. And um, you can either have an energy reading or a um, conversation with, a bit like I've just done this morning. And you can pick the questions. Um, and then, you know, and basically you can use those under, over every, any time period. So it works out to be only £22 per session. Of course, 22 is the sign of the beloved and keep the faith and hope and the star of David. And so that's what you must do on this journey. Do the things that are going to make it an easier ride. You know, that's all... You know, my channel, or that's what my aim to, you know, everything about this is to make it a fun journey, to elevate your spirit, to elevate yourself up into the love vibration, right? So you can then spread that love vibration out everywhere you go. And um, to be honest, you can't do that if you're focusing on the fear and doubt. Because of course that comes across. 
right? So you have to focus on love. You have to focus on the bigger picture. And remember, you're one energy body with your twin. And so if you're feeling fear and doubt, it get, you know, there's a reason. It's because they're feeling fear and doubt. Whereas if you are super confident, super grounded, super strong in your love vibration, it gives them strength and courage too. Because that's what you are. You're both anchoring in love to the planet and clearing fears, doubts, everything else. The more you can be a strong anchor, the more you will bring your treasure home. All right. Well, I hope that helps. And if you want to, the book, um, the description box, um, you can buy the books from Amazon. They're available in paperback and in Kindle version. I have them in both because when I'm out and about and I get a number come to me, I just go to look at that number and it will always be spot on for what I'm doing. It's almost, it is quite surreal. I still am kind of blown away by it. Yesterday I was going to buy, um, it was a duck bun and they gave me a ticket which was number 75. So I looked at the book actually for number 75 and the message again was just so perfect for what I needed right at that time. So I'm just going to finish on, I guess I'll read it now. I'm really sorry. Actually, I'm beyond sorry. It's taken me such a long time to get my shit together <laughs> and declare my true romantic feelings for you. Life has been tough and it's made me not trust myself, not trust that I can make things be good in my life. And so I couldn't trust that I wouldn't mess yours up too. That's why I've stayed away for so long. I'm still battling with my own inner demons and I don't want you to see me like that. You deserve more. You deserve me to be me, the me that isn't riddled with fears and doubts. I'm getting there and I will get there, but sometimes I slip backwards again. All I can say is that I'm really sorry. I want to be the man you fell in love with all those years ago. I want to finish off what we started. I want you to be our final chapter. I love you, my darling. Trust me, I'm trying to make my way home to you. Oh... Well, you can see why that was just a perfect message, again, just to give some insight into what they're going through. So even more reason to be strong and firm in your love vibe because you're the anchor. You are both anchoring love onto the planet. So remember, it's teamwork that makes this dream work. All right, hope that helps. Take care. Bye.